मैं कमी से ये था फेमस पेंटर ओडिशा जतिन दास एंड रिसेंटली विनोद महाराणा इज गोइंग टू बी अवार्डेड विद पद्म भूषण अवार्ड फॉर हिज कॉन्ट्रीब्यूशन टू पटचित्र थ्योरी प्रोपाउंडेड बाय प्लेटो Uh, in which uh, he says that he advocates that uh, in order to be a philosopher king, um, acquiring any form of property and having any form of uh, family uh, is going to put an effect uh, in the um, proper building of a philosopher king who is to uh, manage the complete ideal state. So, um, acquiring uh, and uh, um, Building our uh, own uh, family and property uh, would the hamper. So he said that uh, uh, every woman would be common woman for the state, and their ch- children will be common for the state. Brought up by the state. Yes, sir. Hmm. What is uh, preamble? It is the uh, foundation of our uh, constitution. It is a preface to the constitution. in which we cherish our uh, ideals uh, for a welfare state and uh, um, a democratic state when the uh, constitution of india was adopted constitution of india was adopted in 1949 uh, 29th november 26th, 26th november. november who said uh, okay uh, when did india Uh, had its first nuclear explosion it was uh, uh, named as uh, operation smiling buddha in 1974 uh, who said after this nuclear explosion uh, one politician of south asia uh, he said that uh, even if our people have to eat grass Who will produce nuclear bomb? Who is the politician of any South India, South Asian country? Not Indian. Yes, I don't know. But Julie Chukar Ali Hoto, he was the Prime Minister of Pakistan. How relevant is Indian foreign policy? Foundation of Indian foreign policy. Indian foreign policy is rooted in its. Uh, a uh, policy of non alignment uh, unilateralism being independent in handling the relations with the neighbor, neighbor countries and across the world and uh, its advocacy for uh, um, racial discrimination which is seen in the uh, in its contribution in the apartheid movement in south africa and also india chooses to be a global uh, leader of the global south But tell me some political theories which you like very much, or which you are at ease when we read the in our honors or PG the political history, na? And do you feel which theory, two three theory, theories you tell that you know, you you like their ideas? Sir Thomas Hobbes. Ah, sir, what? Uh, How? Plato, theory of justice, and. Uh, मेकनिकल थियोरी ऑफ द स्टेट हिज कॉन्सेप्ट ऑफ द ह्यूमन माइंड 
that uh, human mind is built up of the particles and uh, the constant uh, evolution of the desires uh, which uh, after the fulfillment of a particular desire Hobbes says that uh, human uh, gains felicity a state of happiness uh, which uh, which is marked up by an evolution of another desires and these desires continues uh, till the human reaches its uh, death the whole of Minerva takes its flight after the sets of Kuala have fallen. The whole of Minerva takes its flights after the dusk and the sets of Kuala have fallen. Have you heard this particular yeah. comment? This is the particular uh, uh, phrase which I have uh, read while uh, reading the book uh, C. L. Weber. It was mentioned. And in which philosopher is Dr. Weber? Regarding, I just forget. What, what it means? What it conveys essentially? It conveys about the era of enlightenment. It conveys that philosophy follows reality. Philosophy cannot be a guide to action. It can merely interpret action. When philosophy comes, it has already happened. It is, I think, in the context of Hegel. Yes. Utilitarianism. Yes. Utilitarianism. Uh, Hegel turned Marx upside down. What do you mean by that? Hegel turned Marx upside down because we are a PhD in political sense, so we are trying to also understand what we have read long time ago. Yes, Hegel turned, see, Marx is that uh, economy uh, is the basic, basic stuff. Hegel which, was basically uh, uh, speaking that idea was the essence of uh, universe. Whereas Marx said that matter is the essence of universe uh -huh. and uh, it is the matter which is uh, regulating and getting contradicted in every history, every form of history and every phase of uh, class struggle. Okay, political science is often a matter of a discussion. What is your, what is your, uh, uh, what is your thesis in this political science continuing PhD? Yes, sir, it is, uh, how, sir. Long, uh, how far you are into it? Uh, one year. One year. One year. So, what is your basic uh, I mean, of the, I mean, the hypothesis of the research? My research topic is concerned with the climate induced migration and displacement of coastal areas in Odisha uh, and more specified to the district of Jagasimpur. Oh, yeah.